minutes. An hour to second cereal cup design has arrived. As you can see, I ended up going with the rounder shape for the mugs after I had that pull on my community tab. This is the second design that I will be adding to my shop. Pretty much for today, I am going to be going through all of the cereal mugs that I ordered and checking for any cracks, any damage that sustained while traveling. My manufacturer shipped all the cups just in this box with no bubble wrap or anything. As I check each one of these, I'm gonna wrap them in some of this honeycomb paper. Okay, hate the sound of that. I feel like that was so uneven. Thank <laughs> you. 
I just bought these. There must have been something that people really want to be about. The player could have been like helping professional adventures and wind up uncovering something. It's just the sentiment I feel after having. trees in the background are just constant eye candy for the entire but similar story. Developing fan, reading that really means that I feel often gets underrated. I still have some ground turkey from last week. I wanted to try making a new dish with it using eggplant.
Costco the other day. Whenever I see this at the normal grocery store, it feels expensive for what it is when I can just do my own. But you know, Costco, Costco knows what's up with the deals, so I had to take advantage of that.
the granola is probably soggy. Tried something different with my hair. I'm gonna get some fried chicken. I've been craving fried chicken for I don't even know how long. Mm, we're fine without a sweater. We're fine without a sweater. No. Definitely should have done two servings. I was gonna make that chicken pasta salad recipe that my mom would make a lot when I was growing up. And I made it before in a vlog. For the life of me, I cannot find the recipe. Why did I add salt?
just finished up the freebies for this shop update. Kind of went with a dessert theme this time. Usually I don't really theme them too much aside from like the season they're released in. I don't know, I've been looking at a lot of dessert pictures on Pinterest, getting inspo, you know. Also I just had to get these done because I've been playing it off in favor of getting other products prepared. So once again, I'm cutting it close with ordering these in time for the shop update. You'd think by now I'd be better at this, but um, I guess I'm better at learning how to do things under pressure. Even when I've graduated school, that mindset still comes back to haunt me. Good morning. How are you? I'm all right. How are you? Just got notification that my scrunchies are finally complete and ready for me to pick off. Since this was my first time working with a manufacturer for the scrunchies, there were definitely some mishaps along the process that made it take longer than I expected to complete all that. There's actually still some scrunchies that have yet to be completed, but this is, I think, 80% of my order, and I'll probably be able to pick up the rest of them 
uh, next week. All of the different styles are available now, so. The lip combo I'm wearing today is this Peri Peri Glossy color. Actually, I got this in a PR package from Clio, and I've really been liking these glosses. And on top of that, I layered the 3CE. This is like a sample size of, I think, a lip tint. I think we are having an avocado today. These are brand new designs, but then I had to get more of the classic leafy scrunchies made as well. I also took the chance to slightly redesign the size of my tags and the coloring just so it would be a little smaller and look a little better fit on the scrunchie. So a few weeks ago when I was at Daiso looking at, you know, my typical desk organization stuff, I found this contraption. And now that I've got a ripe avocado, I thought, what better time than to try using this to make a California roll. I have a good feeling about this. Was I supposed to put this on? Oh, shoot. Okay. Oh, I get it. Whoa, I went so heavy on the rice. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. 
I'm the type of person who rarely ever changes out my daily shower products, I guess. You know how big those bottles are? I feel so bad if I don't use it until it's like completely gone. Finally ran out of my shampoo and conditioner. So I'm gonna be trying out this brand. This is not sponsored at all. I just have been seeing this all over Instagram and yes, the cute packaging and coloring may have influenced me. I guess we're gonna try it out and see how it works. I'm gonna try doing the hair mask before I wash my hair tonight. Say for an even deeper treatment, you should wear it overnight and then wash it out in the morning. But um, I need to wash my hair before I go to bed. Ooh, it's quite thick. Okay, and now they say once it's in your hair, you can like wrap it. Let's see how this turns out. I'm gonna leave it in for an hour or two while I edit the scrunchie photos I was taking today. And then I'll shower and see how it goes. Finished updating the website this morning. Looks like that is everything I need to do for shop prep. Shop update is tomorrow, so not like I'm not doing it last minute. It feels so good to finally be done. No, 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 no. Not sure if this is placebo, but I feel like my hair looks pretty good. I used the shampoo and conditioner last night after I washed the hair mask out, but we'll see how it improves over time. Later today, I have my nail appointment scheduled. I tend to schedule my nail appointments around the time of a shop update as like a little reward for getting it done. So I have a new set in case I want to do a packing with me video. I mean, I can't have my bourbon stiletto for that, you know. I'm just drawn to the same color, I guess. But she's like upgraded because oh, this yes. was the gel. Yeah, that was a gel manicure.
下。It's not even 10 p.m., but I'm so exhausted. I watched a video a few times on how you're supposed to do this. Hello, it is a few days after I have already launched my shop update. I didn't plan on vlogging today, but I wanted to pop in and say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so, so much on the success of the shop update. Behind me, you can already see I've started packing lots of the cereal cups, the collect books, which I've already put in a new order for. They sold out on the first day, but I actually have a few more cereal cups with me today. When I was trying to decide between the two different styles for my mugs, the style that lost, style B, I decided to actually order a few of them to do a little giveaway here on my channel. I'm giving away five of these. This is open worldwide. I will send it to whatever country you may live in. All you have to do to enter this giveaway, follow me on Instagram. I think I will announce this on my personal Instagram at Annika's Leaf. Leave a comment on this video with your Instagram handle so I'm able to contact you if you are the winner a week from now. So July 23. I will announce it on my Instagram story, the five winners. Now I'll personally DM the winners on my account, Annika's Leaf. And Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for making it to the end of this vlog. I think it's another longish one. Don't don't get used to it. Take care friends.